ceremony is happening live here in Ifui, and the governor of Lagos State, Governor Baba Jideson Olu, has just arrived a few minutes ago. The ex governor of Lagos State, I'm talking about Governor, the ex governor of Ogun State, I beg your pardon, Governor Lushek Moshoba, walked in. And as I speak to you right now, the Lagos State governor has just arrived. Like I said earlier, we're live at the very house ceremony of one time Lagos State governor and journalist, Mr. Latif Chakonde, who died at the age of 91 yesterday. The event is to start by 4 p.m. But dignitaries have already started arriving at the venue. Yeah. Muslim clerics are equally around from the from the Lagos State box. And everyone is here to pay their last respect to the one-time government of Lagos State. They are just joining us. I won't miss much. We are giving you live feeds from the burial ceremony of the one-time governor of Lagos State, uh, Mr. Latif Chakonde, live here in Koyu. The governor has just arrived. Uh, several other dignitaries are gradually coming in as well. One time, the state governor, Mr. Rushed Moshoba, stepped into the premises not too long ago.
The Lagos governor is working now, including the The Lagos State Government is coming into Security officials at the gate are are doing their best in ensuring that members of the press remain at the gate and um, it's a little tedious trying to get into So you're live at the venue. Hello. And controversy at the gates has ensured that press men have been kept out. Uh, been kept out at the gates. So nobody is allowed to go in. All of us are outside, locked outside. Uh, the Lagos State Governor, Deputy Governor, and uh, the former Governor of Lagos State, Mr. Mabasindi Radhi Pashala, uh, all came in at the same time and uh, made their way into the compound, into the cemetery. Unfortunately, uh, none of the press officials here was allowed into the premises. They're still trying to find a way through. 
and uh, definitely you see getting life updates from us here. Don't go anywhere. Situation remains the same. Um, first men have been kept out of the cemetery's premises. And from the look of things, we are going to be out here until the ceremony is over and we get to speak to the dignitaries outside. The security officials have not been able to explain to us why we are not allowed in. And they're not giving us any answers. They are not answering us. They are not talking to us. They are simply, according to them, obeying instruction. And that is all they say every time we ask them for the situation of things. Um, I've been here since about 3 p.m. for the event that was to take place at 4 p.m. Just one talk, you know, get to talk, just one talk. Be quiet. Mm. You get man. Sorry, sir. Is there a reason why we are particularly kept outside? They say nobody should enter for now. Since we're talking, guys. Okay, they said nobody should enter for now. Okay, so once the body comes, we are going in. I'll follow the next directive. Okay. See the security official uh, eventually passed the message across to me saying that they have been given the directive that no journalist should go in for now. And I was asking him if we'll be able to go in when the body arrives. And he said, if you get a different directive from the one he has been given at the moment, it will definitely act accordingly. So we are hoping that when the body of the one-time governor of Lagos State, Mr. Latif Chakondi Hoplayon as LKJ, arrives here at the cemetery, we are hopeful that will be allowed entry to the premises. Of course, you trust us at Punch Videos to always give you the very best. of updates to you, our esteemed viewer out there. We do our very best in ensuring that we keep you informed and updated. And the situation of things at the cemetery here in Ikoyi is that press men are not allowed 
into the premises, at least for now. When the situation changes, or if it changes, we'll definitely give you updates. Clerks from the Lagos Central Mocks are here. They've been in this very pool now for about 40 minutes. They've been here, seated in the bus or the mini bus. And uh, we are hoping that when the body of the late governor comes around, uh, we are hopeful that uh, we have access to the premises. One of the gatemen was talking about social distancing. I mean, the reason why we are kept out here. And I'm wondering if. We are exercising that here outside now. Although about 70 to 80 percent of people here are wearing their nose masks. We are live here at um, an Ikoi cemetery where the one time Lagos State Governor, Mr. Latif Jakonde is going to be late to Mother Earth. Dignities have started coming in already. The Lagos State Governor and his deputy, alongside one time Lagos State Governor, Mr. Blatin Diraji Fashela, are all here, but they've made their way into the premises. Yeah. Please, the governor is coming. The governor is coming. Can you move back, please? Back outside. Can you move back? The governor is coming, please. Move back, please. The governor is making his way out.
Situation is still the same at the cemetery where the uh, one time governor of Lagos State, Mr. Lati Jackman, will be laid to rest. Yeah. According to reports here, uh, the solution is being sought for as regards the situation of journalists being placed outside. The event is uh, really yet to begin because the body of the late governor is yet to arrive. Although we have the governor, the deputy, and uh, Mr. Wabakuni Radipashuha, a one time governor of the state, present at the premises already. The Liberal Central Mosque, Islamic clerics are still here. They are outside, they are in their box. They've been there for close to one hour now. And the body is also yet to arrive. But we have many people here. Um, we have people outside, like you can see. Dignitaries, politicians, security officials, journalists. People from all walks of life here to celebrate. The life and times of the ex Lagos State Guard. I don't need to push out. Hey, Mr. Man. You don't need to push out. You are not an animal. What about you now? What about you? None, none. 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 None, none.
Finally, we are in. After what seemed like a long time, we are in, and that's what is most important uh, to give you the very best of all this. We're going to be giving you live updates as we already do. Uh, yeah. At the burial ceremony of Mr. Latif Jakondi, one time Lagos State Governor, who died at the age of 91 yesterday, Baba Kikire, as it was fondly called, breathed his last yesterday after 91 years of living and service to the people of Lagos and Nigeria in general. What is yet to arrive? We have Islamic clerics from the Lagos State Central Mocks outside. The Lagos State Governor is equally present alongside his deputy. And the one time Lagos State Governor, Mr. Babas Nuradi Fashola. Thank you. 
They are still here. <laughs> Avolt and Dad is Kui, where Mr. Latif Jacondi, Blai Lunal LKJ, uh, or Baba Kikiri, will be late to rest. Okay, the Islamic clerics are beginning to come in now. Uh, Allowed into the building, allowed into the premises. And that is uh, Mr. Shegman Shoba, one time of the state governor. Just waiting for pleasantries to be done with before we approach the other statement to see if you oblige us with a few moments on air. Okay, all right. Uh, sir, we, we, we would like to start by wishing you our, uh, sending you uh, our condolences uh, on the death of um, the, your leader and your friend. Uh, what, what words do you have to say about the kind of person he was? Is it going? Most hard working human being I've ever seen in my life. I'm happy with his life. I'm happy that the best thing, the best thing, the best thing, the vision of the world. Okay, sir. Sir, we, we are looking at uh, development back then and the, the level of governance uh, we are we are we are having now. Um, Many people believe that what we saw back then can no longer be reciprocated at this moment. What, what, what's your opinion about um, this? Yeah, we, we must bring to continue his legacy. That is the only way that we will sustain his reputation, his life. That we should have been by day. So, how does he do with him? My father is a teacher on this one. It is too early. We, 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 we sit down and discuss on it. Sir, transmogrification in the past uh, looks more like it was genuine from the political leaders we had compared to what we are seeing now. As uh, someone who has practically seen it all, sir, uh, what's your view about this? I have Before that, we have some little problem here. Let us give it the help of some of this book. That's it. Thank you very much. I was one time with the governor, Mr. Olusha Mwashawa, giving us 
an exclusive interview there uh, talking about his leader according to him in journalism and politics the late latif jack islamic clerics are now here in the building other political leaders are also around and we are awaiting the body of Mr. Lati Chak. policy the commissioner of police in the US state, Mr. Kim Odumoso in the building. We are here live at an eco cemetery where one time the best governor, Mr. Latif Jakandi, will be placed in Mother F this very day. He died yesterday at the age of 91. Yes, you are right. Uh, within the arrival of the body. Of Mr. Latif Jakande. In Kui Cemetery, Boats and Gardens.
You can see people exchanging pleasantries. As they gradually continue to pour into the premise of the cemetery. Okay, you are just joining us. We are live here at Nikoi Cemetery. The final lanes to the ceremony of Mr. Martin Jacondi, one time people state government. The journalist who died yesterday at the, at the age of 91.
dignities from various walks of our life uh, in the premises to the body. Of the one time government is still being expected here at the cemetery. The clerics are around, dignities are around, led by the number one man in the states. Members of his team.
if you're just joining us, we are live at the well, ceremony of one time Lagos State Governor, Mr. Latif Jack Kondi, here in Ikoi, where his remains will be placed into modern death. The only thing delaying the ceremony from commencing is the late arrival, arrival of his body. The images have been here for Well over 30 minutes. And of course, uh, these individuals are led by the number one citizen of Lagos State, the University of Mexico, Mr. Badili Sumulu, his deputy. Political leaders in the state. And of course, the ceremony can't begin if the body is not here. So we all are waiting for the body to arrive before the commencement of the program. Signatures are still coming in through the gate. Thank you. 
Everyone is waiting patiently for the arrival of the body. And um, the reports have gathered as it that the body is actually not fired from where we are at the moment. And that there was a slight delay in the process of bringing the body down. Everyone is patiently waiting for the arrival of the remains of the late ex governor. Everyone, including the current university government, is that Robert G. Son Olu. While the waiting is ongoing, people are catching up, interacting with each other exchanging pleasantries. The governor is deputy, one-time governor of Liberty State, Mr. Albertin Dwali Pashala, one-time governor of State Governor, Mr. Lishek Mashoba, and other political dignitaries. are in this hall in front of me, and they are probably doing their own type of catching up.
Why are you going online? Punch, please stop this for now. No, the governor is here. Stop this as I'm talking now. Stop this. What is the reason of people asking this? Oh, God, don't ask me that question. Why? What, 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 what purpose is it now? The, 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 the is not yet here. What purpose is it? Excuse me, sir. I don't know who you are, but it's by myself. And I'm asking uh, Mr. You. Governor, personal from this party, we want to know. Okay. The uh, essay, Mr. Koshili. I can't relax to be doing it, Abby. Mm -mm. That's not what I but said. But I'm going to meet you this now. Okay. Listen to me. Sir, stop the video now. I'm talking to you. Are you going to listen to me? See, read very well. If you don't stop this, that's why we have, we have issues. Why are we having issues? Stop the video. She cannot. I have an extension. No, you have to give me an explanation because I am not to continue the right. video. I will ask if I stop you on to point you out. You can try me. To God, me. I will read you now. I'll stop you to point you out. I'm not even going to take this part for me this But I'm telling you now, you're dragging with me. Move your camera so that you can pick my voice. And I'll stand on it. What's the cost of video now? I mean, now. Let me get you right. You don't give me any explanation for them. Have you, are you surprised that Mr. Governor brought everybody here? Excuse me, sir. Ask your question. Do you listen to me? I'm not ready to listen to you. Are you superior that Mr. Governor brought everybody here? I've been doing this for about 40 minutes or so, and we, I've done interviews, at least I've done one interview. So I'm asking you why you're asking me to stop the video, and you've not given me a reason. The only thing I'm saying, you want to get yes, copy on to bond me out, I'm looking for the reason why you, I'm not, if you, I'm not disturbing you, I'm not putting the camera on your face. I don't get your point, sir. So if there's a reason, you tell those other as I'm asking you, why? What's your reason? Did you get me, sir? Hello, sir. These are the food that I've never witnessed. You see that I've told you, I've told you. I, I think they will also be witness. That is the problem. You can't just say I should stop it without an explanation. You have to you continue. With it. Okay, this is and this and this is why. You can continue. You won't threaten me and say you're going to bond me out. That's what you did. You said you're going to bond me out. You're going to bond me out. Threaten you. That was what you just did. Stop this thing. Stop this thing. See, look at me. If you don't understand the use of English, huh? You don't use the word threat for me again. You get that? Okay, I so never what, what you, you by saying don't that tell me you're that going to get scorpion. What does I'm I don't going to get scorpion? Whatever you want to say, whatever you want to say, how you want to say, I don't what care. But you, you don't ever, you don't ever tell me I'm threatening you. Don't ever, you don't ever tell me that I threat you again. Do you get that? Don't use that word, that language, that that for me again. Listen now. I'm with you. I'm with you, Oga. Do you know what the problem is? You came and said, what media organization? TV. I want you to get me. You're not getting me. My question is, I'm not infringing on your rights. We are just doing the live interview. Very easy. There's no stress. And you tell, you're telling me that. You will get Scorpion to go and do me out. Relax. Using all forms of, there's no need for you to explain anything. Because whatever you want to explain, I had your you guys. God bless you. God bless you. So read it off. Please. Thank you. See.